Hello everyone, welcome to our Krav Maga class. I'm Owen Malul, I'm a Krav Maga and fitness expert, and today we're gonna teach you guys some effective and practical self-defense moves. Okay guys, today's class, we're gonna be handling the three most common mistakes people do while learning self-defense. Number one is gonna be handling attacking. Attacking, it's a concept that is very important. To know how to attack, it is very important. We cannot just know how to defend. Because there we have an attacker attacking us and we're just defending. And in the way, in, on the way, we're gonna get the strikes. I cannot defend forever. If I defend one or twice, I always need to oh, attack in order to stop the attacker and run away. But what we see mostly when, we'll, when people are trying to learn self-defense is the first move they learn when they go to their first class is a punch, <laughs> okay? Now, I'm not saying, guys, very important to say, it, I'm not saying a punch, it's not something effective or strong. What I'm saying for, that for the normal people that are not with 10 years experience and they're not well-trained to throw a punch, is a mistake and I'm gonna tell you why. We have a lot of cases while people in, in a street fight, they throw a punch. Now, 50% of the time or even more, I'm sure even you guys heard about someone who got into a fight, gave someone a punch and guess what? Broke his own wrist, broke the knuckles, broke his own hand. Now we don't wanna break our hands while actually trying to defend ourselves. Now, if I'm gonna hit Snee with my knuckles to his head, here his head is very solid. And what's gonna happen to my knuckles? Boom. Imagine you punch a wall. What happens? You break your knuckles. The bones against the wall, the wall is winning. But in Krav Maga, what we do is we react with open hands. So even if we miss him, we do not break our own knuckles. So first most common defend is attacking with a punch. Second most common defend in, uh, while people trying to learn self-defense is trying to react against an attack with what, they, what we try to call effective defend. In Krav Maga, we are looking for the most effective, but the first principles we're looking at is not so what is the most effective, is what is the most natural and instinctive motion to do while someone attacks you. The third concept is not planning how the attacker, how the attacker react right away after the first counterattack. And let me explain. So here, we're gonna be handling a, a knife threat. And to understand the third most common mistake what people do while learning to defend themselves, we're gonna be learning what a lot of people I see doing against a knife threat. And here you, you, you could be throw it on any other technique. Okay, this is already a technique. That means that he's threatening me. Whoa, maybe he wants out of me something. Of course, if I can give my money, I give my money. Now, what a lot of people do is trying to redirect with one hand, attack with your other hand. Now, it doesn't matter how strong you are, and how strong you're going to attack. Sneer, he wants his knife back. Pull the knife. One more time. One. Boom, it doesn't matter. He's gonna, and pay attention, while he's pulling the knife, he cuts veins, he cuts my hand, and that's very dangerous because he has the knife back. So here, a solution of Krav Maga that we're going to be learned step by step after class. Whoa, come down, come down. Pull the knife, pull the knife, pull the knife. Pull the knife, pull the knife, oh! <laughs> Here I got, for instance, the knife close to my body. So it's all of my body against his hand, and not just one hand, right? So don't be naive that if you do just defend with one arm, attack with the other, he's just gonna stand there for you. <laughs> not at all. We always have to analyze and plan and check what is his motions after the first defense. And here are the three most common mistakes what people do while learning how to protect themselves. Thank you guys for joining our Krav Maga class. I'm Orn Malul, and remember, 
A single move can save your life.